Good afternoon, my name is James Morris and I'm a past National Vice Commander, past Post Commander, and past Department Commander. And we're in the Glendale Cemetery in Cardington, Ohio, recognizing Veteran Memorial Day. I go ever to watch where so gallantly stream. Well, we, we usually have a lot longer program. We usually have the Gettysburg Address, Logan's Orders. We usually have a speaker and posting our flowers at the memorial or at the monument. Uh, uh, we had to adjust it for a shorter time to try to keep the distancing from people due to COVID-19. And what we did today was a short version. But it was here to honor all the dead from all wars. Well, we started by the posting of the colors, and then we had uh, bagpipes play Amazing Grace. Then we had the national anthem and the raising of the flag. I did the opening prayer. And then I did the POW MIA missing table ceremony. Then we had the 21 gun salute and taps. What's different this year is we didn't have as many people. Usually the cemetery is packed with people. We were unable to do our full program because of COVID-19. So we did a short one. And I believe the people that showed up for it appreciated what we did. And it was an honor for me to conduct the ceremony. I'm the post commander of Jenkins Bourne, American Legion Post 97. I've held commander 12 different times. Memorial Day is very important to our post and our area. It's a time for us to remember those who gave, their, gave so much for this country so we can be here today to do this. The peace, the peace we have and the freedom we have is just because of all the veterans that sacrificed so much and a lot of them gave their lives so we could do this every day. We did uh, come out and decorate all the veterans' graves. We did over 600 and about 620 graves in this uh, cemetery of veterans. Put flags out on everybody's, every veteran's grave. We normally have chairs out here for people to sit on. We didn't put any chairs out, so we keep them separated a little more. And um, we told people on Facebook, when they did come out, uh, not, not get all one group, just spread out a little bit. We also asked them to put posters in their porch or on their, in their windows of their house, remembering a veteran that was out here. So we did all that ahead of time. Well, it's very important to us because we wanted to uh, remember the veterans and also it's with the COVID-19 we want everybody to be safe and not get uh, COVID-19 that's why we had them spread out and do things like that to help them out a little bit. I was just glad that there was enough a lot of people here they spread out all over the cemetery and that really made it uh, special to us.